Welcome back Future Medicos. In this video, we will be covering Jawaharlal Nehru Medical College which is located at Belagavi in Karnataka. This medical college is affiliated to KLE Academy of Higher Education and Research which is a deemed to be university. This college was established in 1963. So this college is in existence for more than 60 years. So looking at the seat matrix for this medical college, this college offers totally 200 MBBS seats out of which Karnataka government quota or Karnataka state quota, there are 12 seats. All India general category 158 seats and All India NRA category 30 seats. So there are three major categories in this medical college. Only Karnataka students are eligible for the Karnataka state government quota. Other state candidates cannot get a seat under this Karnataka government quota. If a Karnataka student is interested in this Karnataka government quota, they have to register with KEA, Karnataka Examinations Authority and participate in the online counselling. Whereas for the All India General Category and All India NRA Category, you need to register with Medical Counselling Committee or MCC. Now for these two categories, All India General Category and All India NRI Category, there is no domicile. Anyone can participate, including Karnataka students can participate here. So if you are a Karnataka student, you can participate for the Karnataka Government Quota under KEA, as well as you can also participate under MCC for All India General Category or maybe All India NRI Category. Now what is the fee structure for General Category? The fee structure for general category is 19 lakhs 15,000 per year. The first year is 19.2 lakhs and the last year it is 9.6 lakhs. So this fee structure is about 90,000 more than what was collected last year. So there is an increase in fees compared to last year. So what is the total cost? The total cost comes to 86.25 lakhs for completing MBBS under general category in this particular medical college. Then what is the hostel and mess fees for the general category students? For girls, um, uh, double sharing, non-attached, uh, non-attached, uh, there is no bathroom attached. Uh, admission fees is 200 rupees. Caution deposit is 13,000 rupees. And yearly rent is 86,000 rupees. So total cost at the first year will be 99,200 for the girls. For boys, again, uh, double sharing, non-attached uh, room, 200 rupees admission fees, caution deposit 16,000, room rent is 92,000. So total cost at the time of admission is 108,200. Now this room rent also includes the food charges, that is breakfast, lunch, evening snacks and dinner. So this is hostel and mess fees. So the fees is uh, somewhere between 86,000 to 92,000 per year. So the college fees is about 19.15 lakhs. This is about 86,000 to 92,000. So roughly about 20 lakhs or slightly more than 20 lakhs is the cost per year. So total cost 86.25 plus let's say 5 lakhs here. So somewhere between 90 to 95 lakhs is the total cost to complete MBBS in this medical college. Now for NRI students, the fees is 44,000 US dollars per year. First year is 45,500, last year is 24,000. The total cost is US dollar 201,500 US dollars. The fees is the same as last year. There is no change. Uh, if you convert it to Indian rupees, um, as per Google, one US dollar is approximately 83.51 Indian rupees now. Uh, so the total cost to complete MBBS under NRA category comes to somewhere around 1.69 crores as of today. Then the hostel and mess fees for NRA students. For girls hostel is a double sharing attached bathroom. For a normal students, general category students, it's a non-attached. But here for NRA students, they provide attached bathroom. So double sharing attached bathroom, uh, 200 rupees admission fees, caution deposit is 30,000. Yearly rent is 1,25,000. So first year is 1,55,200. In fact, the cost is the same both for boys and girls. It's 1,55,200. On a yearly basis, you will be spending 1,25,000. College fees is 1.69 crores. And for hostel and mess, it would, let's say, come to about 6 lakhs. So we are talking somewhere about 1.75 crores. So for general category, it is roughly around 95 lakhs. 
whereas for NRI category, it is roughly around 1.75 crores. Now, for the Karnataka state quota or Karnataka government quota, the fee structure is 3.25 lakhs per year. This fees is applicable only for Karnataka students. Other state students cannot apply under this category. So, for Karnataka students, if they get a seat under Karnataka state government quota, that 12 seats, they will be paying only 3.25 lakhs. But if they get under general category, they also have to pay 19 lakhs per year. Now, of course, this 3.25 lakhs is based on last year fee structure. I still don't know what is the fees for the current year. So once KEA releases the prospectus, you can check what is the exact fees. As of now, you can take 3.25 lakhs as a guidance. Now, what is the closing rank last year for the deemed or general quota? In 2023, you can see that round one closed at 1,79,000 all India rank. Round 2, 1,56,000. Round 3, 76,000. And stay round closed at 28,000 all India rank. So every round you can see that it is becoming more and more difficult to get into the deemed university. It's becoming more and more competitive. If you look at the previous years, it was like 1,53,000, 1,56,000. So it varied somewhere between 1,50,000 to 1,80,000 all India rank. If you are between somewhere between 1,50,000 to 2 lakhs, probably there is a good chance for you to get a seat in this particular medical college. What is the closing score? In the previous years, it was around 430 to around 500. Maybe um, this year, the closing score may be higher, maybe around 500 marks. Anyway, right? Look at the rank. The rank is more reflective. Now, how about NRA quota? NRA quota last year, the first round, there was no demand, right? 11,27,000 was the closing rank. Even then, there were some seats vacant. But round two and round three, it became uh, more competitive. 7,22,000 and 5,26,000 finally closed. Uh, 2022, uh, it was quite competitive. 9,47,000, 5,80,000. And in round three, there were no seats vacant. By round two, all the seats were taken up. Uh, 2021, there was no demand at all. You could see that all the three rounds, there were seats vacant. In terms of score, not a lot of competition. So just pass mark was more or less sufficient. If you go in the first round, a pass mark will get you a seat here. So moving on, Karnataka state quota, this is the closing rank for 2023. So various categories I have shown in round one and round two. For example, general merit uh, closed at around 32,444 All India rank. The marks may not be relevant. Look at the All India rank. So it should be 32,444 was the closing rank for general merit. Category 3 BG closed at All India rank 51,800. Category 2 BG closed at 61,247. Category 2 AG closed at 74,462. GMR category closed at 79,800. 2AH closed at 83,000. STG closed at 149,000. SCG closed at 159,000. So that is the uh, closing rank. It could see that most of the seats has been taken up in round one. Only general merit, there were some vacancies in round two. Other than that, all the others, you could see that round one and round two, there is no movement in the other categories. Now that's the information I wanted to share. Just the disclaimer, the fee information is as displayed at the college website. And the cutoff marks uh, or ranks were collected from MCC website and KEA website respectively. Thank you. Bye-bye.